This 10-metre-high mural by street artist Smug depicts St Mungo, the patron saint of Glasgow. When it was unveiled in 2016, an image of the artwork received over one and a half million hits in its first week. And St Mungo is one of over a hundred new works that make up the city's mural trail. I'm Jane Lilo from Glasgow City Council and we manage the City Centre Street Art Mural Programme. The reason that we promote murals is to brighten up drab and dark areas in the city, gable ends and other parts of buildings, and also to deal with graffiti hotspots. By funding and supporting murals, the council's not only been able to generate a new sense of pride in the city and change the way people think about certain areas or their sense of place, They've also created a new tourist attraction, bringing a new generation of visitors to the city. And rebranding Glasgow hasn't just meant thinking about experiences and events during the day. Stroll down the banks of the Clyde at night and you'll get to see the conference centre, Squinty Bridge and all sorts of other buildings in a completely different light and bringing people onto the streets at night is great for the evening economy, as well as making the streets feel safer. By lighting the city's monuments, towers and other public buildings, the planners have helped make Glasgow one of the UK's few truly 24-hour cities, further enhancing its international reputation as a vibrant place to work and play.